Hey, what's going on YouTube? Typical Tour Reviews back with another video. Really awesome video. <laughs> As you can see in front of me, the title and the thumbnail did not deceive you. We're looking at Dabbing Squidward today. An actual figure of Dabbing Squidward. So here he is in the flesh. This is from the Masterpiece Meme line by a company called Alpha Group. They somehow got the licensing from Nickelodeon to make these characters depicting Spongebob characters. Here's one from series one, Sponge Gar. And this dabbing Squidward is from series two. Series two also had the scene where Spongebob's running from Patrick in Jellyfish Fields and he hides underneath the rock and Patrick's hanging above him. But it's just uh, tired Spongebob. Series one had Sponge Gar, had Handsome Squidward, it had uh, Imagination Spongebob. It had Patrick sitting down with his jaw dropping. And uh, I think that's it. These retailed for $20. And they are made out of like a vinyl material. You can see Spongebob here. He's about 5 inches tall. Probably about 7 inches wide. And the Squidward is closer to about 7 inches tall. Uh, they just come in this big square box. It's just an open window on the back. I don't know that season two or series two ever released. I never saw it in stores. I think it got canceled, but the inventory was already made. So these figures ended up showing up at places like Ross and other discount outlets. I had to buy mine on eBay and I got it for about retail. Um, but once I got it in hand here, it's a really cool figure. I wish they were cheaper because I would buy like 10 of these guys and just line them up on the shelf. Um, if you ever had a flocked Funko Pop, that's kind of the material he's made out of. His shirt is that hard vinyl plastic, and his uh, tentacles, suction pads are like a rubbery vinyl. But everywhere else, he's like that flocked, fuzzy material. Oh, and his eyeballs are actually uh, more of a harder material. It's almost like a rubber. The shirt's hard plastic, but the eyes and the hands are like rubber. <laughs> and then on the top of the head, he's got his splotches his wrinkles it does have this ring which i think was from the plastic clamshell that was holding it in um i'm hoping over time that will kind of pop back out but it might even be intentional i don't know because it's like a perfect circle uh, but just a really neat figure if you guys aren't familiar with the meme it's not bad it never was an actual meme it's from a um parade where a guy in costume was dressed up as squidward and somebody was filming him, and for whatever reason, he hit a dab. Uh, maybe the people in the crowd told him to, I don't remember. <laughs> but it's, it's a hilarious thing. And to see it actually get incarnated in toy form is awesome. Uh, like I said, you can find this guy on eBay for right around 25 bucks, free shipping. But yeah, so that's it. I don't know what else to say other than it's really cool. And it is a really good likeness. It looks pretty much just like it. On the back there, you can see the licensing. It does say 2020, but like I said, I never saw it um, actually show up in stores. I did get this guy at Target. He was on clearance for 10 bucks, but that was over a year ago. So again, he was Series 1. This guy's technically Series 2. And like I said, being Series 2 only had two figures in the line. That's what leads me to believe that it was actually canceled. Uh, but yeah, so go ahead. Let me know if you guys have any figures from this collection. And go ahead and pick it up. Definitely check eBay. Uh, I ended up getting Squidward for 17 plus 5 shipping and tax. So right around 23 which is basically retail if I were to find it in the store. Um, a lot of people have it like 25 free shipping around that range. So yeah, like the video if you liked it. Definitely something different. <laughs> Definitely something really funny. If you're not big into collectibles, this would still be a really funny conversation piece just to set out. People would say, why in it do you have that? Uh, real quick, I can show you the inside of the box. I have this really cool artwork, different variations of Spongebob. So yeah, that's it guys. Just another video for you. Thanks for watching. Comment down below. Like the video if you liked it. And subscribe. And hopefully we'll have some more content in the future. I just don't.